Well, pickleball is filling the void at vacant malls and museums across the country. A growing number of communities are converting empty spaces to meet the demand. Fox Business correspondent Madison Allworth is in Samford, Connecticut with those details. This used to be a Saks Fifth Avenue. They still have the escalator here, but when you come over this way, you see that it is now Pickleball America. When this opens on Monday, it will be the largest indoor pickleball arena in the Northeast. I want to bring in Jay as I join his game because he's the one that outfitted this space. Jay, why did you choose a mall as the home for Pickleball America? This mall was perfect. One, it was in the center of town. It had great bones with open space inside, and we could go quickly. And then, you know, quickly, good bones. It was also vacant. It was vacant for two years. What did the mall say when you came to them and told them, we want to take this vacant Saxon Avenue and make it a pickleball court space? Oh, the, the mall was more than a static. They loved the idea. They loved the idea of foot traffic coming through it. Almost 500,000 people will come through here in a year. And then we become a destination and also an anchor store at the mall. Right, and I think that's so fascinating because when you look at brick and mortar, it's struggling. You look at pickleball, it's the fastest growing sport in America. What about that marriage makes sense to you guys? Oh, well, just the number of people that were going to come here, and especially on the East Coast where you get rain and snow, it's going to be packed. Love it. Okay, so they open on Monday, and uh, it'll be open for memberships. They've already sold 250 before they even open the doors. So there you have it. In Stanford, Connecticut, I'm Madison Allworth, Fox Business.